You know, right now, I think it's so fun and exciting. But I remember when I first started, I just got my ass kicked. I have this sentiment that I think whatever sport you enjoy is really awesome in Alaska if you're good at it, but it's a challenging place to learn anything. It's interesting because I started paddling in Alaska over 15 years ago and there wasn't a lot of whitewater boaters. And I've watched the whitewater population or you know the whitewater crowd grow pretty quickly as uh, pack rafting has become more popular. However, if you have a feather, um, like I do, it's fixed. My name is Jewel Harley and I own and run a whitewater pack raft school and I've been teaching and guiding throughout the state since I moved here. I really remember what it's like to be scared and to be beginner or learner boater. Being able to be present with somebody, teach them a skill set, you know, you watch it click. Like that to me is super rewarding. I think there's a lot of folks getting into outdoor recreation that are willing and ready to like have someone teach them how to do it better or more safely. And two in Alaska, I think pack rafting is kind of the dream place. The hiking portion of pack rafting. Some people call it raft packing. Oh man. Hiking in Alaska isn't always straightforward or easy. The burliest terrain you might travel through with a heavier load than you're used to. Better enjoy when with company and with people you care about. cheesy, but they are a tool for the wild. Seeing pack rafting grow, kind of a light bulb went off, and we could really use a pack raft guidebook. And having had over a decade of background paddling a lot of these really popular pack raft runs, I was kind of like, oh wait, I could do that. And then also I'm watching kayaking slowly grow. Sometimes people get into pack rafting and that's like their gateway into whitewater kayaking. think about it, hear about pack rafting. I hope they get excited about it. That's why I still live here and why I still do this stuff. Every trip I go on is inspiring and humbling. Makes me feel very small. I found uh, some measuring tape. Uh, and I just measured my head. It's uh, about one foot and three inches. Big brains. <laughs> Do you want to measure your head, Sam? 